Get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. Just need to follow them to the security module. There we go, a security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. we have some sort of software problem. We're calling in a specialist. Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep. Target spotted. It's Spider-Man! There's the second module. We have some sort of software problem. We're calling in a specialist. Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep. There's the second module. What? All agents, someone's taking control of one of our subsystems. Initiating Delta Protocol. Man, everybody's got drones these days. Sable teams, I need a status report. Exterior sweep negative. We are all clear. Still look like a software issue? We don't know. We're evaluating. Please maintain current alert level. Okay, just two more modules. Attention all Sable teams. There's a small possibility we have a trespasser on site. We're analyzing data now. Stay vigilant. Copy that, Control. There it is. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy, Control. Bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, I gotta find that last module. There's the last one. Nice. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. Nope. Nobody here but the spiders. Switching to a secure line. I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait, is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? Neo statue. What are you talking about? The Neo statue from the auction house. 
They must be talking about that file MJ found. Jackpot. GR-27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. Whoa. GR-27 is devil's breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. Hey Pete, what's up? MJ, get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders but its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michaels' location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound. That could go bad fast. I should head to Central Park. Would you look at that? Half the crime tower's back up already. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets... Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it. But the chief was warming up to Spider Cop. His casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around someday. Like an RPG in. to wake you up. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach in. Where are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him! That place is crawling with guards! How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Whose bright idea was it to put a circuit board in a fence? Out of the way. What was that? Gotta move. Now. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. Need to draw him away from the stairs.
It was nothing. What the? What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. <clears throat> Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. I do not want leaks to press about Michael's or Devil's breath. On it. She's nervous. Standish my Crap. Generator tripped. I won't distract him for long. How's it looking? Convoy gonna be ready? Bye bye. Get that truck moving. Should have been uptown half an hour ago. Copy. We're rolling. Truck's about to move. Should use it as cover. units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for Pandemic. Looks important. Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. Hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass. Or us. Again?
Move it. <sighs> Close. Come on, come on. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Okay. He wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. What? I've heard your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> Oh, what that the was hell? not a sable guy. Definitely not a sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. That was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. I'm flying pretty close to blind. Ought to look for towers to activate. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. Out, destroy my background research, and the best you got is sorry, Charlie. Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military. You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? Fine. Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. All units, there is a box truck believed to be armed with a bomb. Officers needed in Upper Chinatown. <laughs> Now, but I think the cops are on here. Here's your stuff. Damn bomb in the truck. Gotta get it out of here.
like that movie with the bomb on the bus. What was it called? Fastness, super quick. No, that wasn't it. That's Miles' mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Drio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please, call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim. Or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us. No. I'll get him next time. All units, we're receiving reports of an armored car robbery. Reports are coming from the lower east side. Over. Confucius Plaza. I could use some of his wisdom. Pigeon alert. Oh, come back, little birdie! Nothing like putting my skills to good use. Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and uh, there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. Hey, Howard, I think I found one of Pidgey's cousins. Dusty Gray Flex, might have just left a stain on my suit? Clarence, guy's a little devil, but he's a charmer. Give him a pat on the head and point him towards feet. He'll find his way. No problem. I'll do the same for any others I find. Pigeon. Oh no, there it goes. Lost him. Pigeon. Oh no, there it goes. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Would you believe it's for welding? Provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. This is it, Peter. Our breakthrough. The neural interface will put Octavius Industries on the map. Do we need to run a safety check, Doc? It's been run and rerun. No foul-ups this time, Peter. I haven't felt this confidence since grad school. We're on the verge of something great.
Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter.
I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... It can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Showed up with stains on my shirt, ten minutes late from stopping a mugging. Still can't believe Doc hired me. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye. An RPG to wake you up. Ten thirty four. Officers are taking fire from demons. Officers near Bowery, please respond. What are you doing here? just made your last mistake, punk. What the? 
Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? You hurt? You're Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros, okay? Okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time, but when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's... It's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing. Don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet. When they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw. Okay, okay? I can <clears throat> Oh, sh... S sorry. No, no. No, <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> you keep that up and, uh... You'll be fine. All right, lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh, thanks. You know, anytime. I just punched Spider-Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would've bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Keep moving. Keep moving. Whoa. Farmer's market. Kidding me? It's gonna take forever. That drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. Have you seen him? Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecured. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. I think I'll stay clear of those guys. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. I think I'll stay clear of those guys. Continuing sector sweep. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Maybe I could turn on that siren. Under the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. You're lying. We have footage. Oh, man, I just gotta go home. I have the authority okay. to arrest and detain him. Stay calm. I gotta distract him. Maybe I should just watch you. See anything? No. Damn, there's a lot of broken glass back here. It's a New York alleyway. What'd you expect? I thought they'd be cleaner, obviously. 
I see anybody back here, I'm throwing them in a cell. Continuing sweep. Mom? Hi, honey. Did you make it to the feast shelter okay? Uh, yeah. Almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. This is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. I love you so much. We'll get through this, okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. I'm seeing, seeing death, dead demon faces. You know what? I'll just keep breathing. I'll, I'll be back soon, Mr. Holmes. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um... What can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. I am a piece of junk. <clears throat> oh, hell! Damn hunk of junk! Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these when they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Got time. Get it going. Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, hey new kid. I'm empty wife, here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's going to be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, kid, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool. Might be able to improve
Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. Resolved. 